So in the start, uh, last uh, tutorial, you have seen how to create a simple um, Android application and then connect it with your Firebase, uh, uh, Firebase project and uh, retrieve device token and send a push notification from your Firebase uh, console. Now in this video, what we'll do is this part of the tutorial, what we'll do is uh, we'll uh, do the same thing actually. We do the same push notification uh, using uh, AWS. To do that, what you have to do is you have to log into your AWS account, which I have already done. And then you have to search for SNS because I am going to use um, SNS service uh, to connect. Uh, and then what you have to do is you have to go to your push notification and then uh, create platform application and give it a name. So maybe I'll give the same name. So FB underscore tute one, right? And then uh, you have to choose the platform. So there are many uh, platforms supported by it. So what you have to do is you have to choose this FCM. And then uh, you have to give your uh, API key. Okay, you have to submit your uh, API key, which you will get from your Firebase console. So if you see this, um, I will, if you go to this uh, Firebase, uh, you will get this uh, API key, right? So if I go here and then somewhere here, here, if I go <coughs> and um, for this project, uh, I'll go here, project setting, and um, integration, and um, I'm not sure where is that, okay, cloud messaging, yeah, so Okay, and then you will get this um, key over here, and then you have to put it in this location and then say create platform application right now once that platform application is done um, you have to create application endpoint and uh, here you have to put the device token so the same device token what we got over here so you have to take this and then Oops, not here, so you have to copy from here and you have to put that and create application endpoint. And once that is done, you can publish that message to this endpoint. It's actually pretty straightforward, but it don't work that way. So if you see this now, uh, if I send a message, say, there are two ways. Either you can say identical protocol for all delivery. So here you can just say the wrong message, uh, uh, raw message. So if I say hi and say publish message, so it will say that um, it will show that public message has been published. But actually there is um, there is nothing, nothing gone over here, right? Uh, so what you have to do is actually uh, this has came after a lot of you know, research over internet is that you go to publish message and instead of identical uh, payload what you have to do is you have to uh, you have to um, you have to choose this guy uh, custom payload and here um, this format has to be changed this format has to be changed to something else so which I kind of got after a lot of research and kind of copied it over here uh, so where is my okay So 
so you have to you have to follow this this step you have to keep it exactly like this okay now if i go over here and paste it in this region and here you can put your title so let's say that again let me keep high high six and body as high six again and now if i go over here and say publish message you see that it came over here so high six so this is a pretty short video but i hope you got the idea that how to uh, how to um, send message from sns uh, simple notification service and if you have that ready you can even create topics and then subscribe to that this application to that topics and then whatever you publish on this topic you can it can also be done over here there but uh, through sns it is little uh, tricky in the sense that that formatting is the trickiest one which i have uh, explained so thanks for watching and